so you probably want to exploit and execute scripts on Roblox the website or Microsoft Store version. Well, everything is patched. No, today we are happy to release a new version of Netflix CE, the only working script executor for PC. It's got a complete makeover and it's even more powerful. Now supports load string, read file, write file, faster injection and execution. And the most important feature, it is completely free. So let's get right into it. So this is the file that you need. The link will be in the description for this. It's going to be omgexploits.com. After you get here, if you scroll down, you will see it right here. Buy from bypass. I still have to update the picture, but it's going to be this right here. After you've got it, you're going to get this right here. So just put this on top of your desktop. After that, open it. And then this is what you will see. So this is the actual exploit in the workspace folder. I will show it to you later. Here you can place scripts and it will actually show on the executor. So just open the Roblox Studio right here. Open it just like that. And if you can see, this will open right here. The credits go to 1DNT on Discord. This is the developer that made this and updated it and made it even more powerful. It is a Discord link. It will get you to our Discord server. There you can get the latest updates and also support if you encounter any errors. So now you just need to open Roblox. I recommend you using the Microsoft Store version of Roblox because it's a lot faster. It gives less errors and it's overall a better experience. So after Roblox opened, it's going to be this game right here that you have to join. It's from this user right here. So just search up the user just like that and then hit on people. And you will see it right here. It's going to be this guy right here. If you scroll down, view full profile. Then just go to creations. Hit on this tab right here. And then it's going to be the game player right here. There is also going to be a link in the description if you want to use it on the website version of Roblox. So then just hit play. After you join, you will see this right here. It's going to have a key system. It won't take long to do and it's a 24 hour key. So you just have to do it once every 24 hours. So that's actually pretty cool. So just copy the copy the link. So just control A and control C to copy it. Then paste it in your browser just like that. And you will be getting here. You just need to wait five seconds and then press on continue. Then you'll be getting here just press on get website and then it's gonna create your key just wait five seconds again and then hit on continue and then if you can see you just got your key so you can just copy it and then you can do check whitelist and if you can see verified user so now you can actually use it so in here it will show some games it supports more games than it actually shows right here but you can actually join whatever game you want by placing it the place ID right here then pressing on this you can get the place ID just by looking at those numbers right here in the URL of which game that you want to join is going to be these numbers right here but first I want to show you blocks fruits is going to be right here so I'm just going to press on play and then it will teleport you to the game so you just have to wait a little bit if you can see we just got here so now when you open the Netflix CE if you press on inject and just wait a couple of seconds it should say please equip tool and then combat so now you just press on ok and then do not close these leave them opened when you press on combat if you can see welcome to netflix ce and here we are if you can see here it shows the time remaining that you have on your key so it's gonna be 23 hours remaining actually 24 hours remaining so in here you can execute whatever script you want also load string and http get and also some save scripts right here if you can see it's actually a lot of them it has like the dex right here let me open it if you can see you have this dex right here which is a lot better that we than we used to have also a full bright script infinite yield let me open it as well sometimes it opened this because it's getting the infinite yield from somewhere else so if you minimize that if you can see you have it right here and the decks right here also an infinite jump if you can see you can jump an infinite amount of times an ability changer for blade ball an anti fk as well an uh, anti fling auto parry 
three different auto parries for blade ball if you can see also a block fruits esp for fruits but if you can see there aren't any fruit oh if you can see there is an ice fruit right there so you can just go get it on the next island there is cmdy there is control teleport so whenever you press control you can teleport wherever you want if you can see there is an fps booster fe flip so this is really cool so if you can see whenever you press z it's gonna do a front flip and everyone can see this so this is actually pretty cool and you can actually spam it and just fly like this there is a fling script as well free game passes which is really cool a, a god mode a headbox changer so now when you see a player i mean there aren't any players around me but there's a lumber tycoon script also a murder mystery 2 esp present life spin 260 power if you can see you spin like really fast there is a tool movement script as well and an universal aimbot and this actually works there is also an esp if you can see you can see whoever you want to see on here also the headbox and also the aimbot when you activate it if you hold right click it will go to the nearest player and i guess that's the nearest player right here it will hold uh hold your aim on them so right here i just created a paste bin linked with uh, print this actually works lol and then i'm gonna paste it right in here and now if i press f9 and i press on execute if you can see this actually works lol it will print out whatever it is in there and if you can see this is the actual paste bin of it so you can actually use load strings and here i have another load string that goes to an fps gui so if i execute it if you can see this op fps gui will open up press e to lock on a person o to change a uh, team based mode i also have an animation script right here in a paste bin i'm gonna execute it and if you can see this just open up you can do pull and if you can see now it's gonna do some animations it is fe so this is pretty cool as well so right now i just joined again i didn't have to do anything it verified me automatically and if you can see you'll see the game that you just joined to continue it you can also play blade ball without changing anything you can just hit play and it will actually work so one of the best things about this as well is it will save the session that you inject it into so now whenever you're trying to inject it will do it even faster because it has the last session so you just hit an inject wait a couple of seconds and if you can see it already got it and then if you press on equip tool if you can see netflix ce opened let me also show you the read and write files so let's you have a script make a new text document i'm gonna name it script and then i'm gonna put in here like print working uh read file okay now if i go in here so it's in my workspace folder if i go in here and if i do and now if you put print read file and then script.txt and you hit on execute if you can see right here print working read file so also if your roblox studio uh, netflix ce closed while in game you can just reopen it and then hit on inject and then just tap okay to re-inject hit okay and now if you can see it will work so if you make a load string and then read file if you can see it will execute wherever is inside of there this has to be open and working for it to work if you want to write file you can just do this and then put the name of the text file and also the text that you want to put in there if you hit on execute if we go in here if you can see we have a script too and it's gonna say lol now we are actually aimbotting if you can see guys we are aimbotting on this guy with the uh headbox extender he didn't even hit me and we killed him so now if you can see he just spawned again and we have the aimbot again so we can just kill him again really as easily but yeah guys this was the video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video